So there we go, a wand. How did I not notice this? Is that what I think it is? What the? This is a baseball card. So as you guys can see by my setup behind me, I clearly love two things in life. Star Wars as evident by my Mandalorian theme shelf and then the rest of it is baseball. My entire career and life going forward has been dedicated to the great game of baseball. We all love it. And today, the setup is about to get a little bit better as well as your setup back at home because not only do I get a huge package from our friends at Auctions of Champions, we'll talk about them in just a second, but if there's anything in this box that you wanna take home with you, because it's the holiday season, I'm gonna be able to give away some of the things inside this box. As long as it's not anything Grady Sizemore, Cliff Lee, or Josh Hamilton related, that's what I sent in the email. So if there's anything like that in the box, I'm sorry, I have to keep it. But in this bad boy right here, I mean, Oh, Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. What? It's not from Amazon. I know it's in an Amazon box. I do not know Jeff Bezos personally. But Christmas came early at Casa de Fuzzy. And again, I mentioned it earlier in the video. It is from a company called auctionsofchampions.com. It is a website. If you go there right now and register using the name Fuzzy, they'll know that I sent you. And maybe if we get enough people to go on over there and really just, you know, enjoy the experience because it's a great website. You can get anything from baseball to basketball to Star Wars or anything pop culture related. You can put it in bids. And if you put my name in while you register, maybe Maybe we can do a second video where we open up even more which gives you all a second opportunity to grab some stuff in a giveaway we're gonna go ahead and open up this because it's in my hand I have not seen anything inside this box I'm not going to fake a single reaction but I'm pretty sure that this is going to be a picture I am not what, what? hold on I think it's a, it felt like a vinyl at first and I don't have a vinyl machine this is a you guys will see it before me I don't know what that is I'll turn it sideways Whoa! I have an autographed Mariano Rivera signed portrait. Uh, hopefully, I'll be able to have it focus. And again, every single item that you get from auctionofchampions.com, it will come with a certificate of authenticity. So next up, we have a jersey. So we have a... This is not real. Look at this, number 25, Jim Tomey. And this is one of the retro jerseys as well with the cool letters. I have to kind of go through these items a little quick because there are so many things to unbox, so do not go anywhere. But hey, this is amazing so far. Two Hall of Famers, Jim Tomey and Mo. Oh, no way. My favorite pitcher of all time. I don't know if you guys recognize this autograph from back in the day. This is number 31, Cliff Lee, my favorite pitcher of all time. It's not even close. Oh, my setup is going to be looking pretty. So this is one that is off limits, unfortunately, as well as the Jim Tomey. I will not be giving away anything like that because those are some of my favorite players of all time. Glaber Torres, number 25. This is something that if you are a Yankees fan, you might want to go ahead and DM me on Twitter saying, hey, I got my eyes on that one for Christmas fuzzy. Maybe hook me up. So again, thank you so much for sending me that. That is awesome. So we have two Yankees in today's video so far. Uh, let's go with this jersey right here. What is this one? It looks like a, yo, not good and live in the flesh. Again, I don't want to take out every single jersey because I don't want them to get wrinkled or ruin the packaging or anything like that. But I had to see the Jim Tomy jersey. Let's do another, let's do a photo. Let's see what's in this one. All right, so we're going to go ahead and rip open this bad boy. What is this one? You guys will see it before me. Is it upside down? Ooh, hold on, hold on. I guess I'll see it before you. <laughs> This is when Robin Ventura and Nolan Ryan went at it and Nolan Ryan made Ventura his son that day. So that is awesome. I'll go ahead and add that to the pile with Mo. Again, I am not just throwing them. I am putting them in a nice, neat pile. Oh, Hall of Fame of 90. So this is Jim Palmer of the Baltimore Orioles. I don't know if you guys can see, but that is Oh man, this old school Baltimore Orioles jersey. I, you know what? I have to open up this one because the Orioles have one of my favorite jerseys of all time and I'll put it nice and neat back into the wrapping. Wow, look at this. Wait, what does that say? What does that say? Cakes? I have no idea what the cakes are. You guys might have to let me know in the comment section down below. Does that stand for crab cakes? Are crab cakes famous in Maryland? I don't know if that's what that means, but we'll go ahead and rock out with that. We have yet another jersey. This one is 
Robin Yout. I am getting Hall of Famers on Hall of Famers. So this is from, this is a powder blue former, I, I don't remember what, this is probably from the 80s or the 90s, but here we go. Robin Yout in the flesh. I mean, this is just incredible. I cannot believe it. And it's also signed. Can you guys recognize that? Does it look familiar? Because from the back, I can't tell. This is Jim Tomey, a Jim Tomey signed bat. So that is going to look awesome with my Jim Tomey signed jersey. Oh my, oh my. I know he went a little bit crazy towards the end of his career and he was injured and maybe not the nicest person after his career was all said and done. But look at what we got. I'm gonna take it out, I have to, because I've never seen this in person. This is a Josh Hamilton signed baseball hopefully it will focus up right there he's he, he might have been tied with Grady Sizemore as my favorite player of all time I read his book it's called Beyond Belief his ability made me love baseball even more so I credit a lot of my success to Mr. Josh yo you you're not serious right Juan Soto you sent me a Juan Soto signed jersey Juan Soto I'm not lying that says Juan Soto right there. And he's number 22, which is my favorite number in the... Yo, you guys are spoiling me. Again, Christmas came early in the fuzzy household. Let's go to this one. This looks like a Red Sox. Who is... Wait, no. This is my... This is the best video I've ever made in my entire life. This is... This is Shohei Otani. One of my favorite players to watch in the entire game. The best position pitcher since Babe Ruth. Someone that can throw 100 miles an hour and hit a ball. 460 feet and is autographed again everything comes straight signed sealed with a certificate of authenticity from auction of champions remember if you register use fuzzy because maybe we can make more of these videos because this is so much fun Ooh, we got a nice little manny machado padres jersey it is signed just like the rest of them Ooh, his autograph is actually pretty slick at the very bottom you can see it right there yo no way a full-fledged josh hamilton jersey and this one says First Peter 224, so I'll have to look that up after the video is over. And I, let's unbox that in just a second because I really wanna see what that looks like. So we have a couple more jerseys and baseballs. If you are a Juan Soto fan, today might be your lucky day. There we go, Juan Soto nice and clean on the front of the baseball. Hopefully you can see, let me see if I can get it up nice and, I don't know why it's not wanting to focus, but uh, this camera sucks. Wow, <laughs> can we send him a bill? So there we go, a Juan. How did I not notice this? This was literally sitting out there and I had no idea that we had a Sammy Sosa. <laughs> Sammy Sosa, a he's a living legend in my opinion. One of the most prolific and controversial players in the history of baseball. We can see his autograph down in the right portion of the jersey. That is just amazing. I cannot believe that I'm holding that so. Sammy Sosa, let's add him to the collection. I'm looking at all of my jerseys and everything I've gotten today, and I just feel so blessed and so lucky. So again, I have to give a shout out to you guys. You made this all possible. Is that what I think it is? What the? This is a baseball card. A gem mint, I don't even, I think this is good. A gem mint 10, Fernando Tatis, Junior, let me see. Look at that. The owner of the New York Mets, I believe just bought this company. It's called PSA. They grade Pokemon cards and everything like that. So Steve Cohan has a say in today's video, or at least he will going forward. A gem mint 10, Fernando Tatis Jr. tops 2019 card. This means that he was a rookie. I have a rookie. This is the most fun I've ever had in a video and we're not done just yet. I don't know. Wait, hold on. This, this this can't be real. This cannot be real. I, I don't even know what I'm looking at. This is a Gem Mint 10 Ken Griffey Jr. rookie card. I, I think that's good. I, I'm, I'm in disbelief. I have absolutely no words for what is happening in today's video. Is this real life?
I can't wait to give away some of this stuff to you guys because clearly I cannot fit all of this in my setup. So auctions of champions just absolutely boggled my mind. I did not think it was going to be this much stuff. Please go make an account. Please go register using my name. Maybe buy something. Not everything is $450 million. You can get some stuff on there that is very, very reasonable. Yo, have you guys ever seen that movie Major League? Do you guys see this name right here? Let's see if it shows up. It says Charlie Sheen. This is a 99 Wild Thing jersey. <laughs> So I've actually seen some of these in random sporting goods shops, but none of them have been signed. So this is going to be a flex on my grandpa, who again loves everything that has to do with the Indians. So grandpa, I'm sorry, this one is staying with me. So what we're gonna do now, I think there's, okay, there's one more baseball that I can open up. And then we also, I don't know what could be in this massive folder, but I'm excited. Just like everything else, I mean, there's no way that it's gonna disappoint us. This has been an absolute Banger! All right, so let's open up one more baseball. This is actually the final one. I am very sad. Pete Rose, no way. So Pete Rose actually comes into my dad's furniture shop. If you guys ever need furniture, my dad works at RC Willie in Las Vegas. So this is a Pete Rose signed baseball right there. I hope that it will focus. I probably have to get a new camera for something like this, but for today's video, I'm almost fairly certain that it will definitely work its way out. We have a massive folder. So, so far we've gotten Cliff Lee. We have gotten Josh Hamilton. I'm wondering if this is going to be, like, of course, it would be Grady Sizemore, save the best for last, my favorite player of all time. But if it's not, I mean, there's absolutely no chance in the world that I could ever be disappointed. I'm going to guess it's something Cody Bellinger. That is my final guess. Let me know in the comment section down below what do you think it is. So we have a massive folder. I'm going to let you all see before me. I don't know what that is. Another piece of Sammy Sosa memorabilia. This one right here is a, does it give a specific moment? I'm not sure, nope. So this is just Sammy Sosa hitting an absolute bomb off a very, very unfortunate pitcher. It is obviously autographed, just like everything else in today's video. So I would have to say some of my favorite things that we got from Auction of Champions. Okay, make sure you, yeah, nothing else is in that. Let me check the box. That is completely it. So I am in disbelief. I would say right now, these two cards, the rookie Fernando Tatis Gem Mint 10. This is from PSA, as well as the 1989 Tops Now Rookie Ken Griffey Jr., one of my favorite players of all time, one of the best swings, probably the best swing of all time. Those are up there as some of my favorite items. The Juan Soto jersey, the Josh Hamilton jersey, this actually means a lot to me. He is one of the reasons why I started making videos. Say what you want about him after his career, but when he was in his prime, one of the best players all around that you could possibly have, number one in the draft. Thank you so much, everyone, if you made it to this point. And again, a massive, massive shout out to Auction of Champions. I was not expecting this much stuff and they have completely blown my mind. So thank you all so much for watching. Please go register. Tell them that I sent you. And if you want to see a part two, let me know. But I mean, Josh Hamilton. We have Jim Palmer. We have a Cliff Lee signed baseball. We have just everything that we could ever hope for. A Josh Hamilton ball. This is a Manny Machado signed jersey. So please let me know if there's anything that I can do for you on Twitter. If you want any of this stuff, maybe we can work something out. But... I'm feeling very blessed and lucky today. So let's see if I can get this stuff framed, put in the back of my setup. And these videos are about to get a whole lot more fun. Stay safe out there and peace out.